Hey everyone. One of the many ways that you can use Splay is as a large and portable desktop size monitor. I'm here at our office where I use my Splay every day connected to a laptop. Um, but I use my Splay everywhere at uh, suppliers, at coffee shops, at different co working spaces, uh, at the airport, hotels. It's an extremely flexible solution to give you a big screen anywhere. But there's some idiosyncrasies depending on how you're connecting your display for this second screen experience, whether that's on Windows or Mac. I'm going to take you through the different ways to get an optimal setup on each platform. So when you first connect your Mac to your display, it'll connect as uh, 1920 by 1080, which is good. It's probably fine for a lot of you, uh, but the, the text are going to be too small for some of you. The icons will be too small for some of you. And so if you want to fix that, there's a few ways to do that on Mac. Uh, first, we go into the display settings on Mac. And we see there's these scaled options. And so we can go to 1600 by 900 or 1280 by 720. And we see we get much bigger icons. The problem is that the, the Mac is literally reducing the resolution. Um, and what we prefer is HIDPI, which Mac uses as a way of um, aliasing and combining pixels. Um, unfortunately, that's not available on 1920 by 1080 displays. But fortunately, there's a program called Better Dummy, and we can just connect that and we get much better text than we did at 1280 by 7, 720 or 1600 by 900. Um, so in Better Dummy, you can choose um, different HIDPI resolutions uh, that will look better if you want uh, slightly larger text and larger icons on your Mac. Uh, so I highly suggest Better Dummy for those of you who are using a Mac and connecting it uh, to your display and you want slightly larger text or um, larger icons. Um, and if you're okay with just the 1920 by 1080 and it's not too small for you, uh, that's great too. So fortunately, connecting display to Windows and controlling the, the size of text and the scaling on Windows is significantly easier than on Mac. So on Windows, we just have to pull up our display settings. And so I, you can see I have my display side by side. Uh, my display is my main display. And you just scroll down to scale. So you want to make sure your resolution set to 1920 by 1080 because it's the native resolution of display. If you want smaller icons, you can choose 100% uh, scaling. And so you get you know smaller text and icons. Um, and then you can go all the way up to 175% and it doesn't lose resolution unlike uh, Mac where you have to choose lower resolutions. It just does a much smoother job of, of scaling. I usually use it at 125%. I find that comfortable, 125 or 150%. Uh, Windows recommends 150%. Um, but it's uh, much, much easier to control display scaling on Windows than, than Mac. Uh, but regardless of which platform you use, uh, display gives you an awesome dual screen experience anywhere, that desktop size experience anywhere, and we're really excited for you to have one soon.